What do you want, Sheridan? Um, I, I just came by to see your mother. I, I didn't know you were home. Yeah, I'll bet. Thought I was still in jail in Boston, huh? Well, yes. Yeah. Well, I hate to disappoint someone who always gets her way. But I got sprung. Don't worry, though. I'm only out on bail. There's still a shot you get to see me strapped to the electric chair. That's not what I want, Luis. I'm glad that you're out. Liar. You've got a lot of nerve calling me a liar. I don't think so. You know damn well if I hadn't flown to Paris to save your behind, you wouldn't even be standing here. Wait just a darn minute! Man, surprise, surprise. You know, when things don't go your way, you have me thrown in jail on the lamest, most trumped-up charge you can think of. Kidnapping, Sheridan! Get real. You know, it would almost be funny if you weren't taking food off my family's table to satisfy your own childish ego. I told you I did not mean for things to go this far. What did you think was going to happen? You know what gets me the most? Is that you hate me so much to go after my job, and you know how much my career means to me. There you go, twisting things around again. Give me a break. If you want to see my mother, why don't you go over to your place? I'm sure you can find her scrubbing one of the crane's floors down on her hands and knees. Damn it, Luis! I will not let you talk to me this way! Well, then get out, Sheridan. Get out of my life and stay out. How dare you act all smug and self-righteous and make it sound like everything that's happened is my fault. Well, if the shoe fits. You're the one that broke trust with me. And just for the record, I never once lied to you. That's a lot more than you can say to me. I never lied to you either. Please, don't insult me. That's the biggest one yet. You know, I'm getting sick and tired of you shoving this in my face every other sentence. Now, what the hell did I ever lie to you about? You've got a lot of nerve acting like you don't know. Oh, here we go again. Look, forget I asked. You want to believe that I lied to you about something? Be my guest. I couldn't care less what you think about me. Well, finally he tells the truth. Oh, damn it, Sheridan. Why don't you get out of here now? Well, they have to add murder to my charge of kidnapping. You know, as it is, you're probably wearing a wire. Use what I say against me in my own trial. Oh, that is so ridiculous. Yeah, is it? I guess I lost my sense of humor with my job. What are you talking about? Oh, don't act like you don't know. I'm suspended from the force until my name's cleared. Oh, that is, if my name's ever cleared. I didn't know that. Oh, I don't even say it, Sheridan. Don't say you're sorry when you're not. But I am. Why can't you understand that all of this happened because I was angry and hurt at you for what you did to what, me? What, saving your life in Paris? No! Before I left Harmony! You really thought that we had something real going on. And then to find out that it wasn't the same for you. Oh, well, what wasn't the same for me? What the hell are you talking about? So you're finally going to tell me the real reason that you went back to Paris. I left because I... Uh, uh do you want me to come back later? That's not necessary. Uh... Luis wanted me to leave anyway. Yeah, do what you gotta do, Sheridan. You always do. Please, just tell your mother I came by. Now, I, I know you're upset with Father because of his reaction to the bad publicity. I don't want to talk about that anymore. I, I'm not with you, not with Luis, not anyone. Luis? Yes, I was just over at his house right now. I went looking for Pilar, but who do I run into instead but him? Uh, Sharon, sure. you really should, shouldn't go over there. I know. And I'll stay away from now on. Mm -hmm. But I actually, for a moment, felt that we might be able to clear up this misunderstanding if I just explained to him that I heard him say he was using me. You didn't tell him, did you? No, I didn't get a chance to. Oh, thank God! <laughs> Why does it matter to you anyway? Because you're my beloved sister. I'd hate to see you waste one more minute of your life on that scurrilous cat. You know how he feels because you heard him say it. What's the point in asking him about it so he can lie to you again? Sheridan, 
Is there no end to the abuse you're willing to take from that man? You know, just, just for once, I would like to have the satisfaction of him knowing that I know. I mean, at the very least, it could knock him down a peg or two, make him realize that he, he couldn't pull the wool over my eyes. You know what? Changed my mind. I am going to confront him about this. Oh, no, you can't do that. Why not? I'll handle it, all right? What? Julian, where are you going? I really thought you cared about me, Louise. How could I have been so wrong? I don't care what Julian says. One of these days, I'm going to...